All right, hey everybody. Welcome back to my cooking channel. Today we're gonna be cooking puppy chow or Muddy Buddies. Um, we call it puppy chow in the Midwest, so I don't know what everyone calls it down in a faraway land. Currently I am 26 hours away from you guys, so and it's super rainy and gross out, so we're gonna make something really fun. So, so you're gonna need some powdered sugar. Um, you'll need about a cup of powdered sugar. Then you'll need half a cup of chocolate chips. So I already measured this out with my measuring cup. And then, so here's the chocolate chips that we used. And then you'll need about, um, say about three cups of just like some Chex Mix that we'll give you. And then you need some good old fashioned peanut butter. Um, and then here's my little helper, but she's not going to have any because there's chocolate in it, so. Ooh. All right, so you're going to add your um, half a cup of chocolate chips, then you're going to add half a cup of peanut butter, which is kind of a pain. Scoop out and put in a little cup, but you got to do what you got to do. Um, you'll get a big Ziploc bag. I only have this one. So you'll need a bigger one than that, but we'll supply that. So I'm just gonna put all my stuff in this bowl. So we're gonna put half a cup of peanut butter. We'll keep going. Okay, half a cup of peanut butter. We'll mix that in here. So now you're gonna have to microwave this to melt it all together. Um, so obviously get parents permission and don't use anything metal, use like a glass bowl and it might be really hot. So just be very careful when you pull it out. So yeah, get all that in there. Ooh. Okay. Sweet. Looks real, real good. <laughs> okay. And now I'm going to microwave this. We're probably going to microwave it for about a minute, so we'll see after a minute what it looks like. So I did about a minute and a half. Um, that seemed pretty good. Now you're just going to stir it so it becomes like a nice mixture. You don't want the chocolate to be burnt because nobody really likes burnt chocolate tasting. So it's kind of nasty. So it should mix together pretty well. Again, I microwaved this for about a minute and a half. Again, ask your parents first. Make sure it's okay. So now, normally you do this in a plastic baggie, but this is all I have. So you'll just slowly pour it all out. Woo! Ooh, it's a little hot. And then... You will stir it all together. Again, if you have a bag, you can just mix it in the bag and shake it. So mix it all together. So it's gonna look something like this. And it's important that you want it to cool off so that you can put uh, your powdered sugar on top. Because if you wait too long or you don't wait long enough, it will uh, basically melt the powdered sugar off and it doesn't really stick well. So I'd say let it sit for, um, maybe about 10 minutes and then add let your powdered sugar. Sit a little bit. I'm going to add my powdered sugar. So you kind of just want to sprinkle it on or add a little bit at a time. Should be only about a half a cup of powdered sugar. You might need a, you're going to be using a baggie so it'll be easier to mix. So it's looking a little bit better. Just gonna get a coat on it. So this is what your final product will look like. You can add a little bit more powdered sugar and then you just take a little bit and eat and enjoy. <laughs> 